My name is Jadisola Okunwale, bringing an encouraging word from Sacramento, California. And in Genesis 15, we enter into an interesting conversation that Abraham was having with God, and I read. But Abraham said, Sovereign Lord, what can you give me since I remain childless? And the one who would inherit my estate is Eliezer of Damascus. And Abraham said, You have given me no children, so a servant in my household will be my heir. Then the word of the Lord came to him, This man will not be your heir, but a son who is your own flesh and blood will be your heir. He took him outside and said, Look up at the sky and count the skies, the stars, if indeed you can count them. Then he said to him, So shall your offspring be. Abraham believed the Lord and he credited it to him as righteousness. Have you ever been in a situation where you're trusting God for certain things and it's just not happening at your own timetable? Yes, we have all been there and Abraham the father of faith was there as well. But the good thing, the great thing was that he had a relationship with God and he posed the question to the Lord and God spoke to him and let him know that Eliezer of Damascus was not the plan. Abraham was already making plans for his own predicament by nominating Eliezer. And so he heard God and he believed God. And so in your situation, faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word. Listen to him. Ask him. Tell him what is in your heart. He will respond. He will answer. He will let you know what his plan is. And his plan for us are of good and not of evil. To give us a future, to give us a hope, to give us an expected end. Let's trust him. Let's have let's find peace today. And Isaiah 40, 11 says, He will lead his flock like a shepherd. He will gather the lamb in his arms and carry them close to his heart. You're close to him, you're dead to him, and he loves you. And today, find peace and let him speak to your heart. Happy birthday, Pastor Yemi Adeyomi. God bless you and God bless your ministry. Make a decision and give your life to Jesus today. Tomorrow might be too late. Please say this prayer after me. Lord Jesus, I come to you repenting of my sins, forsaking my past and giving up everything that entangles. I give my life to you today and accept you as my Lord and Savior. Cleanse me, Lord, and give me a brand new life in Jesus' name. If you have prayed this prayer, you are now born again. Find a Bible-believing church around you to fellowship regularly, a place where you can grow and develop your faith in Christ. If you are in the Houston area, the Distinction Church is close to you. Come worship with us. We are located at 5250 Barker Cypress Road, Houston, Texas, 77084. You can also engage with us on any of our social media handles displayed here. We would love to hear from you. If you need prayers or counseling, you can call any of the phone numbers displayed on the screen. We love you and God bless you.